In this video, we want to explore the relationships that we can build between elements in our Drupal website, like users and nodes. There are many other relationships that you might have. You might build relationships between two content types. You might build relationships between content types and taxonomies. When you first create a view, you select your base table. That table might be content, comments, users, taxonomy, etc. But when you select one, views excludes all other tables. But sometimes you need access to data associated with your base table in other tables. So for instance, if you choose content, you might want to display user information for the author who has created that particular content item. So in our next example, that's exactly what we're going to do. We're going to set up a view that displays a group of basic pages. And when you click on the basic page, the author will show up with their picture right out of the user table in our Drupal database. So to make this work, we need to get our data prepared a little bit. Head over to Structure and Content Types and click on Manage Fields for Basic Page. And we're going to add a new field for the author. In this case, we'll link it right to the user table. Click Add Field, add a new field type, and this time choose User, because we're referencing the user. And this is going to be our author field. So obviously, we're only going to allow actual users on our site to author nodes. Click Save Field Settings. And in the help text, type start typing in the name of the author and when you do that of course all of the usernames will start to show up click Save Settings so click on Manage Display and you'll notice that the author label is going to be linked to the reference entity in our case that means when I click on the author's name, it's going to take me to their user profile. I'm going to put that in line instead of above. And if you click on Format, you'll notice you have a number of options here. We'll leave it at Label. Go ahead and click Save. So we need some basic content here. Go ahead and hover over Content, Add Content, and Basic Page. This is going to be a series of FAQs, so let's go ahead and just add a basic page called All About Sydney. You can put some fake text in here. It doesn't really matter. Just put something in here. This is my node about Sydney. Of course, the word node means nothing to our end users. <laughs> so this is my answer to all the questions about Sydney. All right, under the author slot, type the word A, because we're logged in today as admin. You'll notice there's a number one in brackets behind that. That's just my user ID. Click Save and Publish. And there's my All About Sydney. My username is linked, and if I click on it, it takes me over to my profile, which at this point is a little boring. While you're here, go ahead and upload an image because that's what the point of this view is going to be. Just grab an image of yourself or anything else for that matter and insert one. And so I uploaded an image with my Drupal 8 hockey jersey and I've added my first name in that field that we added earlier. All right, we're ready for the next video.